Hello. In this lesson, we're going to multiply out a pair of brackets into the form of ax squared plus bx plus c. So we're going to multiply every term in one bracket by every term in the other bracket. We begin with x multiplied by x plus x multiplied by the 3 plus the 1 multiplied by the x and then the 1 multiplied by the 3. So you can see we've covered every permutation. So x times x is x squared, x times 3 is 3x, three 1 times x is x, and 1 times 3 is 3. We can collect the like terms, so we have x squared plus 4x plus 3. For question C, we'll begin with y multiplied by y, which is y squared, and now we will multiply the y by the 5, so that is 5 times y. We'll move on to the 2 term, 2 multiplied by 1, and then 2 multiplied by 5. We can simplify. We have y squared plus 5y add 2y plus the 2 times 5, which is 10. Now we can collect the like terms of 5y add 2y to make 7y add 10. So y squared add 7y plus 10. For question C, we have t times t, which is t squared. t times negative 1, which is negative t. 7 times t, which is 70. And 7 times negative 1, which is negative 7. Collecting the like terms, we have t squared, negative t plus 7t is 60, minus 7. For question D, we have z multiplied by 2, which is 2z. z multiplied by the negative z, which is negative z squared. Negative 3 times 2 is negative 6, and negative 3 times negative z is positive 3z. We can collect the like terms. 2z add 3z is 5z with the negative squared, but we're going to start with the square term and then negative 6. And for question E, we have c plus 4 squared, so we can write that as c plus 4 multiplied by c plus 4. Multiply out the c squared term and then the 4c term. We have another 4c term in the other bracket. And then 4 times 4, which is 16. We can collect the like terms. So c squared 8c plus 16. And for question f, finally, we have 2x multiplied by x. So 2 times 1 is 2, and x times x is x squared. 2x times negative 3, which is negative 6x, because 2 times 3 is negative 6. And then 4 times x, which is 4x, and 4 times negative 3, which is negative 12. Negative 6 plus 4 is negative 2, so negative 2x minus 12. 2x squared minus 2x minus 12. Thank you for watching, and I do hope you found that useful.